everybody, my name is Gabby and I am your McCallum Public Library Teen Department Librarian and I'm here to have an ebook talk with you. Today's book choice is Naruto. Now you may have heard that before or maybe you've seen the anime, but today I'm going to tell you um, about the manga. Now a manga is like a graphic novel, but it's a traditional Japanese graphic novel that is always written and illustrated in black and white and you read it what we would think of as backwards. So you would take the book, turn it the other way, and then read it from right to left instead of left to right. Now, if you're reading Naruto in the ebook format, it's actually a little bit easier because it shows you which page you're supposed to read, and then it actually gives you a little arrow showing you, like, don't forget, read this way. Um, so it's pretty simple. It's a little awkward at first, but once you read a few pages, you get used to it and it's just like regular. It's just like normal. So, um, the story of Naruto begins 12 years ago when a nine-tailed fox spirit is actually destroying his village. And what happens is the village champion defeats this spirit but it has to lock its soul into a baby boy. And that baby boy ends up being Naruto. So as he's growing up, he's kind of seen as very different and almost shunned in a way because the elders of the village remember that that spirit is locked into him. And so because of that, he gets kind of um, some negative, a lot of negative vibes from a lot of people and he doesn't, you know, quite understand why. So he, to counteract that, becomes like the crazy class clown. He's super silly, he always makes mistakes, it's really funny. Um, so even though he has a tragic story, you know, that comedic relief is there to kind of balance that out. And so as he grows up, he is actually training to be a ninja and he's learning the art of ninjutsu with several of his classmates. So in this story, you meet some of his classmates. Um, one of the main characters is a girl who of course he's in love with and she has, she absolutely wants nothing to do with him. <laughs> and then there is a boy who is very, very talented as well, just like Naruto in his skills, but they don't quite get along. And so as the story goes, you know, you learn a little bit more about him and their story, and the three of them are grouped together in order to better their art with their teacher, and I have never read this type of manga before, I'm usually into love stories and not the action, but it was so entertaining. I did not think I would like the action as much as I actually did. So if you're hesitant because of that, read it. If you love action, this is definitely a story you'll love. So um, let me know what you think about it. Um, check it out on our Libby app and uh, I'll see you next week. Bye. Thank you so much for watching our ebook talk video this week. Please, please, please share your thoughts with me by tagging us at MPL Connect, MPL Teens, and tune in next week for our next ebook talk. Thank you.